arrived with a mere shadow of an army. Though it means almost certain death, there is no shortage of volunteers to deliver the killing strokes to the God King's most trusted servants. It will infuriate Xerxes beyond measure. Hydarnes and Mardonius' compound lies across these camps. Come, Dilios, and tread with care. Quiet as shadows, light as feathers. The fewer Persians we rouse, the better. Persian slaves, it seems, have spent a great deal of energy creating opulent quarters for their commanders. Yet our burning it to the ground should take little energy at all. Huh! 
The Emperor's harem, Dilios. By far a more horrific sight than anything I have seen on the battlefield today. What do you suppose would best enliven their celebration of our imminent deaths? My king, these creatures are unworthy of our spears. Including those drunken guardsmen? Will they stand back idly and let us pass? I suppose not, my lord. Ah! <laughs> 
my king. Use these spears to slaughter as many of these hellspawn as we can. No more entertainment for Xerxes' camp. By the gods, I hope you were your master's favorite. Dilios, let's move! Dilios! It's him! The Spartan King! Alone! Truly, Xerxes has smiled upon us this night. Let us see what your Emperor's smile is worth, Persian. Off with the Spartan's head! Quickly! Xerxes wishes it brought to the bedchamber for his horse to fondle at once! You'll not harm him, Persians! Or I vow you will find there are far, far worse fates than mere slaughter! Oh, my God. 
I'm impressed, Ilios. You managed to keep your head in a tight situation. Yes, my lord. I've grown quite attached to it. Knees. Your time has come. Leonides? Here in the flesh? I never dared hope this opportunity would present itself. <laughs> you mean being beheaded by a Spartan king? I'll do my best to make it live up to your expectations then. You will die, Leonides.
asses! Immortals aid me! Ah! <laughs> Curses! It sounds as if we've alerted the entire camp, my lord. I fear you're right. It is well, Dilios. We have wrought as much havoc here as two men ever could. We must leave now. It is unfortunate that we are unable to teach Mardonius the same lesson. Would seem Hydani's immortality was somewhat exaggerated. Like the godhood of another, I am growing quickly certain. Come, my friend. Our last dawn approaches. Savor it. Theonidas stands before us and our allies.